have a fresh. haircut. I love it. I'm gonna get over here so you guys can really yeah. Turn see around. Let's see the, the fade. Look, yeah, mm -hmm, it's Woo. going. Look there. Um, yes. So happy, happy Friday, everyone. I hope you all are having a fantastic Friday. It is such a great day. Happy March first. Happy National Craft Month. We are here to get crafty with you all month long. Right? Yeah, almost because it's National <clears throat> Crafting Month. I mean, National Crafting Month means so much to me because it was always that thing that you just love to be able to have an excuse to get crafty um, even more than we already do. So March is such a great month. It's a transition month. It's one of the reasons why we have our summit, our spring summit in March because I feel like March is kind of like October. It's a very transitional month. It is. We're going into spring. The you know the weather for most people is getting warmer and we're just itching to get crafty. Yes. You know? It's so good and we absolutely love it. So as you guys tune in, share with us where you're visiting from. Let us know what you've got going on. Let me know what you think of my haircut. Yeah, everybody's <laughs> saying nice haircut. Yay! Um, they're talking about their days. They're doing good. Uh, Paxton <laughs> is under the dryer at her hair salon, so she's not going to be able to hear us, but she can, she can see us craft. That's awesome. Hey, Paxton, if you can hear us. Um, I am super excited. Today is the last day of our 20% off sale. So a lot of you all week long was like, wait, it ends on Thursday why i get paid on friday get your year membership the first link down below is the special link so that you guys can take advantage of that for 20 percent off you need to get over there get your year membership for fonts and our bonus courses so much great value happening in the membership so be sure to check that out good stuff good yes stuff. take advantage of that we've seen lots of people taking advantage of it already you do not want to miss out on all the good stuff that you've been maybe watching and hearing about. We also love to welcome first time watchers. So be sure to let us know if this is your first time hanging out with us live. Today we have a lot of fun. This is highly requested, Rachel. Yeah. This is something everyone loves to hear about, loves to know. And it's kind of how we plan out t-shirt designs with our fonts and we included a little taco file. It's so cute. We really got crafty. Two fonts, and we were <clears> going <throat> to manipulate a file for you all today. But this, like Tanner said, is super requested in what fonts look good together, uh, things like that. So we've got like a video for you all that just gives you all the tips and tricks. I mean, it's so good. It's an iron-on project, one layer. We love those, being able to make a t-shirt lickety split and what i love about this is that you can kind of do the designing on the couch you can do it in bed and then the next day have your project ready go home from work and craft like yeah. it's really awesome save it to your you know your ipad or your yeah. pc and then so you can craft with it later if you love it because manipulating lots of these fonts and these files together it's like you make your own cut you file. You do. Yeah, so make sure you save it to use on other crafty projects because yeah. if you walk out with this, you will get compliments and you can oh. say, hey, you want one? 20 bucks, I'll go <laughs> home make it, you know? And That's what the we love, we love, love, love this um, because we have, for year members, you get all of our cut files for a year, tons of new ones coming out every single month, and then you get access to the fonts. And on top of that, Rachel was talking about selling these shirts for like 20 bucks. Yes, you get a free commercial use license to take advantage of our, that license to sell what you make. Guys, this is super awesome. And with the year membership, you get the fonts as a bonus. Again, you get three courses, which is $150 value. That's only $3 less than the cost of the membership at 20% off. So pretty much the courses pays for it so you get like the fonts for free you get all the cut files the year membership tier is your best value and you get the most bang for your buck not only economically but you get all of the bonuses like the fonts and the courses and so the printable that, gods <clears throat> oh my gosh yes don't forget people have been met the commenting saying but what if i just want the printable god sorry sorry you have to be at least a monthly member to get the gods so you can take advantage, get the guide, get some cut files. Yes, but it's you, like a sorry, not sorry, because yeah. you will not regret it, guys. That's true. Um, but if you want fonts and the courses, the courses are awesome. We have one on the maker, one on design space, and the third one, which is probably the best, 
Um, it's teaching you how to build a business with your die cutting machine. Which, which now, love. guys, how awesome is that? Okay, we have our membership. You can sell what you make. We give you all these cut files and all these fonts. Then Tanner shows you how exactly you can use all this yeah. stuff to make money. It's and I awesome. Think, I think our class is a little bit different than a lot of build a business classes. Um, we teach you how, like, more of the business aspect of things to really let you focus on your crafting, but talking about sourcing materials, picking t-shirt distributors, um, finding cheaper alternatives to buying vinyl in bulk, things like that that you will not miss out on. Yes, so and Pam just excited. whipped in. Listen to Pam. Hey, she said, Pam. I have just made and sold $1,500 of t-shirts this past week for high school sports. It used your fonts and charged $35 for the shirts. How oh, awesome is that? my goodness. Making Pam, the money. Congratulations. We love seeing our business um, entrepreneur friends in the group. And that's what we talk about a lot is that we're here to build each other up. Congratulations, Pam. That is something you should totally be proud of. And we're super excited to be part of your journey. So what a great testimonial, yeah, guys. it's awesome. So awesome. We love to see that. But guys, who is ready to jump in. Now, before we jump into it, let us know if you're a newbie because we want to welcome you. But who's ready to start talking design, fonts, and files? So cute. I'm ready. Let us know. Um, Rachel, are there any other comments you want to talk about before we jump into this? Uh, project? People are loving your haircut. <clears throat> really? Yeah. They're I loving love it. it. They're loving it. I love it. I feel fresh. I fresh. text my hairstylist. I was like, can you please cut my hair soon? I didn't even say that, but she was like, hey, I can do it at 1.30. I was like, are you for real? So blessings. Blessings. Um, super awesome. But yeah, is everyone ready to jump into it? Yes. Woohoo. Okay. Whoa, this is zoomed. Oh, sorry. Switch to this camera so they yep. don't see me awkwardly stretch. Stretch. To zoom in. <laughs> yeah, sorry. We were filming a lot of videos today. Yeah, we had lots of great stuff happening. So let's go ahead and sign into the membership site. This is what you do if you're a brand new or a returning member. You have to save your password because look at how easy that was. So much easier. We love it. So here's your dashboard. If you are not already a member, this is, gives you a little sneak peek into the membership. Um, <clears throat> and it's really awesome. So let's go ahead and pick out our fonts. Um, we are looking for spontaneous yep. and the Ray Dunn inspired fonts. So yes, sir. Those are the two we're using today. And everybody loves your sweatshirt. They always comment about that North Face sweatshirt. Listen, Taylor, one of my best friends, he got me the sweatshirt for my birthday. Now, out of all the amazing birthday gifts I did receive, he not only went above and beyond for the, picking out a sweatshirt that I was go obviously fall in love with because I wear it every day. Clearly. Um, but he also surprised me <laughs> with tickets to one of my favorite artists. Oh, man. Artists. He got some brownie points for yeah. that one. And he, he will be milking those brownie points for a long time. So he's just a great friend overall. Um, but we just downloaded our Ray Dunn inspired one. So we'll install that here in a second. But let's find spontaneous. And actually we're using any font, which organizes the fonts you download right here. So we can see if we already have spontaneous because we use it quite a bit. We do. I think we already have Ray Dunn in there. <clears throat> do we? <clears throat> Maybe. Um, let's find it and just make sure it's downloaded. So Ray Dunn inspired. Um, where is it? Wesley, Tater Tots, Surrender, Sierra. Do you see? It? Oh, here we go. Such oh, a and tiny we. One. Sorry to interrupt you. <clears throat> go ahead. We have a question. Tanner, what does one by four mean on supplies? Is it one inch uh, thick by four inches wide? I just answered this email. Oh. It's so funny. We might not have gotten back to you yet. I'm so sorry. Uh, it does mean one inch high and four inches wide. So um, thank you for that question. Thanks for following up. What a great way to follow up if we have not already emailed you back. So great job there. But yes, uh, that is it. And let me see. Um, oh, that's not a question. It's just a statement. Nikki wanted to know what tickets Ta Taylor got for you. To what Ooh, concert? He got me tickets to one of my favorite artists. I don't know what type of music it is. Do you know? Who was it? You don't know? You listen to his music every day while working. Oh, oh, okay. Let me, oh, yeah. What's alternative. I would, Wait, I would just say it it's alternative. I would just say. Okay, it. it's Ben Rector. And if you have not listened to his music, oh, it's probably some of the best love when Rector. it comes to just putting you in a good mood. Yeah, it's like this simple music. It's not deep. No. It's not deep, which I can't do deep unless it's like It's great music. when you're just working, yeah, you know. Yeah, it puts you just in a great mood. So Ben Rector, favorite song from him would be, I love Brand New. It's kind of like his top hit. 
That one's a really good mood. But there's another one that I love that I can't think of the name. It's an older one. But yeah, great music. Um, but anyway, also, we two things. If you have not got your summit ticket, please get it. We are a week away. And the 50 mystery box kits, have you seen in the group, Rachel? Yeah. People's receiving their kits. I know. Um, and if you missed out on getting a kit, I'm just going to say FYI, tickets for our fall summit are going to open soon after the summit next weekend. If you are like, I wanted Tanner to send me a special kit with mystery supplies to help me not feel so overwhelmed about the summit, there's going to be a window, a three or four week window to claim your ticket to confirm yourself for a seat. And that means you are also get, get the kit. Now, last year, almost everyone at the Fall Summit got a kit. At the Spring Summit, we said the first 50 get a kit, period. We're trying to fix it to make sure everyone that wants a ticket, a mystery supply kit, and access forever to the, the classes get in. So we're going to open it for three or four weeks, get your ticket during that time. It'll be a special pre-sale offer um, and you'll be able to get in for that. So hope that makes sense. Um, and if you missed out, sorry. And last note about the summit, you can find a link on the dashboard if you're a member to save $50 on registration. And we had had like two or three messages come through saying they're overwhelmed about the supply list. I totally understand it's a long supply list. Do not let that have any hold on you or any fear about the classes. You guys know we would not put on a summit that you would not be able to enjoy or not feel overwhelmed. Pick your favorite classes that you're interested in if you're not a sewist, guess what? You're not going to have to worry about Courtney's classes if you have no ideas or any interest in that, okay? Focus in on the classes you know you're awesome at. We have great instructors. You're going to have so much fun. So no need to feel overwhelmed. Yes, um, we are getting basically flooded with comments about uh, some unclear supplies that people are like you know on the edge about yeah. and i do want to mention some of the supplies and it's nothing that is going to affect you all or your crafting but some of the supplies is more like uh loose so yeah. some sizes of little things might change only for the product projects that we're making sure some colors might change sure, sure, but sure. some people are wanting exact sizes of this or that so yeah, yeah. so what we're going to do i've been traveling all week due to the summit Tomorrow, I'm going to do a live stream in the membership group related to the summit. That is where we're going to clarify everything. That would if be awesome. If you have awesome. links for this, like links for the summit will be sent out tomorrow. That gives you seven days to mentally and physically prepare yeah. supplies and everything. And another note about the summit, since supplies are so such a hot topic, we have already decided, hey, what we're going to do is we're going to give you guys the supply list like at least three months ahead. So that's been the biggest issue and hurdle for us, and I'm so sorry. So we're going to fix it for the Fall Summit because we're here to really serve you guys. So stay tuned to tomorrow. Feel free to go ahead, send us an email. The email's down here in the description, and ask your questions so we ha can answer yes. those personally as well as tomorrow on the live stream. Yeah, so anyway. and we do have a bunch <clears throat> of just questions related to the membership sure. and this awesome project. So we're going to take another break and answer these and then we're going to jump into designing. Thank you guys for being so patient. Yes. Okay. So Jody says, hey, if you Jody. sign up for the monthly membership, do, did you say that you do not get access to fonts? Jody, you do not get access to fonts. The difference between the two memberships, the year membership is a better value. You're actually getting three months free. So you're getting a lower per month cost, as you can see on the first link down below, um, explains everything. Monthly members get access just to the Facebook group, 700 plus die cutting files, and the printable guide. So that's a huge value right there for monthly. But if you're like, Tanner, I want fonts for sure, and I want these $150 worth of bonus courses. And you trust me, you do. You will want them because we make sure to pack full this membership with everything you guys need. Um, and the year membership is 20% off. All three tiers are 20% off. Um, so you'll see over there, highly discounted for 20% off with that year membership. Go check out that price. Such a great deal when you think about the 80 plus fonts you get today, the over 300 fonts coming out from now until your, renew your next year's renewal fee. Um, great value over there and with all the fonts and uh, 
SVGs and cut falls. Totally drew a blank for a second. Sorry, I was reading comments. I would have helped you. Oh, I drew Sorry. a blank. It's not your fault, right? You're not here to, you don't have to every time. So are there any other questions? Great question, Jody. That's the two differs between the memberships. The um, let me see. Financial incentive, the courses, and the fonts. Uh, no, Oliver, uh, Peggy is Peggy. doing a heck of a job hey, answering some awesome thanks, questions. Peggy. So thanks so much, guys. You all help so much. But no, thanks to our wonderful members, <clears throat> we are good to go. So I'm ready to get crafty. Awesome. Well, let's do it, guys. Let's get crafty. So I'm going to download, I think I already have the Life Celebrations collection on my iPad. So I'm going to kill Cricut Design Space because we just downloaded new fonts. So I'm going to open up Cricut Design Space. Oh, and lots of people are saying they've got their makers like, <gasps> like yesterday, a couple days ago, and they're roaming around on YouTube trying to find some awesome tutorials. So well, boy, guys, are they in luck. We have everything you need if you're brand new to crafting. Be sure to check out the YouTube channel. We have lots and lots of new videos for people with makers. Um, and it's a great time to talk about if you have a membership, there's a course related like with 40 videos that are walking you step by step through unboxing, setup, understanding design space, everything. It's such a great class. And Donna wants to know, is there a way for me to get notified when Tanner goes live on Facebook? Um, it sends out notifications to our members, so be sure to head over there um, and turn those notifications on to make sure. But yeah, we I'm not too, too sure um, about that. So what I'm doing is I'm going over to iZip right now, and we're going to just find what number the fall is. So do, 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 do. There we go. Another ad. We're going to have to put those do, 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 do's in like a pot. Like oh Tanner would be a rich man if he did that. That's funny. So, okay, I'm just going to find which file. We have a happy St. Patrick's Day in this file. We have lots of adorable, adorable files. Um, a lot of people have been asking about um, our awesome St. Patrick's Day goals and things like that. We're not too big into St. Patrick's Day here just because not a lot of people overall are. Yeah, but we do have <laughs> like five, we have lots. ten files yeah, there's for St. Patrick's Day. And there's a few in this collection. So I'm looking for my taco file. So it's number 15 right here. This is what we're using. Taco. We're using a little taco out of this. So right here. I love this little taco. Me too. It's so cute. So okay. First of all, we're going to go ahead and um, contour this adorable little file. And we're just taking out the fabulous. And guys, who all got to watch the live stream with our beautiful designer, Blaze? We gave her $400 of craft supplies. She totally had no idea. She was like shocked, which was hilarious to see because I normally don't get to see her shocked. Um, but it was so much fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. So here's our little adorable taco. Oh, so cute. So adorable. So now what we're going to do is we're going to open up um, our text, and we're going to click on System. We're going to type in Ray Done Inspired, and we're going to type, type in Life Happens. And this is such a great quote. I love this quote. And it's kind of like a spin on the one that we have that says Life Happens Coffee Helps. Right. I was like, what might make me a little happier than coffee? And it just so happens that tacos do. Yeah, for sure. So Ray Dunn. I'm putting these on two separate. Any can, particular reason why? Um, I just like to have make my own spacing and do sure. a little bit more about that. Yeah, just picking your brain. Yeah, totally. No worries. And then we're going to grab a spontaneous under system. Make sure when you're searching our personal fonts that you're not under the Cricut category, that you're just under system. So it helps you find it. And then we're going to type in tacos. And then we'll go ahead and get this again and type in help. So, okay, notice right here, guys, like this looks like a lot, like this is overwhelming sometimes mm -hmm. that we're gonna be able to take this right here and turn it into something so adorable. So totally do not feel overwhelmed. <clears throat> it's really easy. I love, this is some of the tips that I have for you guys. I love being able to take, you know, very, um, like uppercase fonts and things like the Ray Dunn font, 
with the spontaneous curvy letters and things like that because it's awesome. So what we're going to do before we start designing is we're going to go to letter space and we're going to bring that down. And one thing I have been playing around a lot with, especially when making font projects and a project with multiple fonts and things like that, I've been loving the... Um, alignment like the yes. aligning things so everything in uh like one line is life happens and then tacos the word tacos and then our taco and then help is in the bottom i love to attach all of yeah. those separately and line them up it just it helps me make sure they're in the middle of everything for it's sure and handy. what i love right now is that if you do not use smart guides for this project i highly recommend smart guides because it kind of helps you line up things like this it's really awesome so we're just going to move this over. Now we just lined these up. So what you're going to do after you get that set up pretty well is you're going to click on actions and you're going to click weld. Now for me, for tacos, I want to do a little bit more. So we're going to click ungroup um, after we selected that layer and we're going to manually manipulate these a little bit. So notice how we're going to like move this over. That's much better. Um, and once you're good to go, you can select that and you're gonna click weld. And that's gonna keep this all together, um, which is really important. So here's what we're gonna do next. We have life happens. We bring that closer together. And remember, these smart guides are really awesome. It, um, did I turn them off? Oh no, they're on. Um, they weren't working for me earlier either for some reason. Yeah, they were just working earlier. Um, they normally help align up things. Oh, is it because it's not like, I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of It's weird. odd. It normally works like a charm, so just FYI. So now we're going to move our little our little taco, and it's a little large, so we'll size that down just a tad. Okay, now it's working. See see that? So I love these align these lines and yeah. align um excuse me. Smart guides only work on iPads, which is neat. Which is neat. So it's a little bonus for when you're designing with your your little little um iPad. So you can kind of see here this is what we've got going on. I'm gonna move tacos up a little bit. And it kind of helps you. Look at that line right here, if you guys can see that on the camera and the second it line. It just like locks it, it so locks neat. It. So I love that. Um, yeah, are there any questions? Uh, we wanted people to demonstrate, uh, people wanted you to demonstrate smart guides and you are oh, great, right now, great. so that's good. Yeah, so look at this, it's so adorable. I love it. Um, Rachel, do you have any, tips or anything you want Tanner, to say about. that thing's perfect i love it's it perfect so Look here's it. what's gonna happen now you guys have seen we've welded these two together because we used um letter spacing to bring those together to look more scripty then we welded each of these so it would be one image each so what happens is if we click make it right now look at this it is going to put it all kinds of crazy that is not what we want not what we want at all so this is a one layer file we love one layer images and projects not because yes we're lazy crafters as rachel and i talk about a lot but it's kind of trendy to have just one layer of um, one color so if you were going to have multiple colors happening here i would select all of this and i would attach it so you can attach or weld if it's one layer, uh, meaning it's all one color, like in this t-shirt. Now, if you were going to weld on Design Space this image, but the taco is say is gonna be a different color, like gray or something like that, you would want to just attach it. Cause if you uh, welded this and you had different colored layers, it would automatically make it one layer. So for the sake of the video, let's go ahead and attach that. And just remember to only attach um, because you may sometimes have different colors and you don't want to, you know, um, have them change. So anyway, now what we're going to do is we're going to take our t-shirt and size it. Now, I know I like to have my t-shirts probably like at least, I don't know, six, seven inches wide. Um, but we can look at our t-shirt yeah. and decide. So let's open up this t-shirt. We're using, oh, look at this red. Courtney is not a big fan of red. Um, I totally am, but she's not. So we don't but, get too but much But she special requested the shirt. It's probably yeah. where Tanner was getting. <clears throat> well, and there's one behind you, Tanner. I think Courtney. Oh, I got it. This right here. Okay. We have two, so it's nice. So anyway, we're just going to measure this real quick. Um, like I said, I like to do about eight inches wide, and this is a large t-shirt. 
So at least eight inches, I would say, maybe even eight and a half. I don't know. And we're getting some questions. The fonts that were used were spontaneous and uh -huh. Ray Dunn inspired. And Tanya came in a little bit late. Hey, she was Tanya. wondering where our taco is from. Our taco is from the Laugh Celebrations collection. So let's go over this real quick. Rachel helped us. Ray Dunn inspired font from Makers Gonna Learn. You have to be a year member to get access to our fonts. So Ray Dunn inspired and then spontaneous. And we contoured this little taco out of number 15 in the Life Celebrations collection. Taco about fabulous is that one. Yes, mm -hmm. let's show you the file, what it started as. It started as this file right here. Great file. We've done a lot of different things about with that file, um, and it's a lot of fun. We have um, taken the text boxes right here. One, two, three, and four. We took four text boxes, got our text, contoured this out, attached this after we're happy with it. And we're sizing it to about eight inches, just like so. So now what happens is we're going to click make it, we're going to select replace. Here we go, all good to go. We're going to press mirror. We're using everyday iron on in white. And our little, our little standard grip mat, Rach, has been around the I know, box. we are really stretching him out. Yeah, we really are. So anyway, we're going to be able to just go ahead and get crafty with this are there any other questions before we start the cutting process uh yeah which uh file set has the little crafty icon tools oh yeah it's the makers collection so we have a few different ones we have one in the organization collection which has the i think the one in the organization tools. collection has uh several different ones. there's a lot of different ones in organization but if you're talking about the set that's behind me and the ones we were talking about yesterday, be sure to download the Makers Collection. So what's really awesome is as soon as you become a member, and remember today's the last day um, to celebrate everyone getting paid and to kick off National Crafting Month, we have 20% off on the membership. So use the first link down below and pick it up. We'll go over it with you guys right now if you have any questions before we start cutting. So let's flip back over to the camera. Oh, sorry. It's okay. Reading comments still. No worries. Um, so if you click this first link down below, which is really easy to find, you're just going to click it and we're going to open. Um, you're going to be able to see everything you need to know to get registered for your own membership here at makersgonnalearn.com. So it was supposed to end yesterday. You guys requested one more day. Um, so it's here. But if you scroll on down and you know you want fonts, courses, and the best value, click the blue button. You can read about the membership, um, monthly collections, free commercial license, things like that. And it's awesome. So this page already has 20% off. Normally, our monthly membership is $19.99. Our year is $15.99. And our six months is $17.99. So these are already discounted. You can see here the difference in monthly price. This $12.99 is how you get three months free. It's actually that lower price span across the entire year. So that's how you get that financial incentive. And then you can see here the monthly membership, get access to our cut fall library, our membership group, our printable guides, which we love. But the year membership gets access for a whole year. And that means 80 new fonts every quarter, over hundreds of cut falls. Uh, but either tier, as soon as you become a member, you get access to all of the fonts if you're a yearly member, cut files for everyone, things like that. So there's a huge back catalog that you're able to use and craft with, which we love. So yeah, so anyway, how are we doing? Any questions? Uh, yeah, there's always questions, Tanner. Yay. So um, let's see, Evangeline says, where do you normally purchase your blank TV? Or TV? Uh, T-shirts. Yeah. We normally stock up on our T-shirts three for ten at um, Michaels. We love that. If you watched our shop with me at Michaels in LA video, yeah, we talk about that. But these both of these T-shirts were not purchased. Was this one purchased? At that one was. Yeah. Well, this is a really trendy color. Mm -hmm. So I love this T-shirt. We snagged like all those ones. Yeah, they're the trendy. Colors. So they have a good selection every now and again. Mm -hmm. This T-shirt is what brand? I love this brand. It's called Comfort Colors. And they're now sold in, Wa I almost said Walmart, I wish, Hobby Lobby, which their t-shirts are always 30% off, which makes it about normal. Mm -hmm. But you can probably get them cheaper online. But if you need it that same day, which we usually do, um, you know, it's a, it's definitely worth not having to pay shipping and things like that. Yeah, and there there are some good uh, brand uh, blank t-shirts at Walmart. There are. Um, so you can go get those if you want to. Could Walmart they beat has the three for ten. 
Would Walmart beat the The only price? way that I would go to Walmart is because it's so close compared to Michael's is like an hour away. I True. think that everybody has a Walmart close to them. But if Michael's is closer, you better be heading on to Michael's. Yeah. And Michael's awesome. runs sales and things like that. Yeah, I love um, it. But we also have a question. Uh, Elena wants to know before she goes around YouTube looking around, do we okay. have a matte cleaning video? Girl, you know it. We have you covered for literally everything cricket Go related. to us. Just search Tanner <laughs> Bale. You, you will most likely, 90%, have the video yeah, there. So search how to clean cricket mats. Add my name, Tanner Bell, to the title or the search bar. Our video will show up. And it's almost, I'm almost certain that it's ranking in the top 10 when you just put how to clean a cricket mat. You should yeah. see my face. You should see our type of thumbnails, things like that. And guys, we are wanting to be your number one source when it comes to cricket yes. and all things die cutting. Yeah, so, and that's why we take what you all want and we, we make it videos. Yeah, we make it happen yeah. because everybody needs all these resources. So that's what we're here to do is Definitely. help you guys get crafty. And you guys, who is loving this? Rachel planned out another awesome project. This is her designing and being able to take multiple fonts, add a cut file. These are things you guys have been begging for. So we're here to help you guys guide you through picking fonts, designing amazing projects, and making them truly your own. Yeah, we're here um, to help y'all so get yeah. crafty. So we put our vinyl or our HTV iron-on shiny side down onto the mat. We're using a standard grip mat. As you can see, it's been We're going to retire it. We're retiring soon. that mat. <clears throat> and I think it would be easier to use if it was still on cardstock and things, but it, where it's such a shiny side, you know, it does take some extra... Um, Grip. Yeah. Yeah. So we're giving a little more pressure. We've turned fast mode on. We're using our fine point blade. So that means if you have a beautiful Cricut Explorer 2 or Explorer in general or Maker, you're able to enjoy today's project. So I'm going to press that flashing Cricut button and get us going. So yeah. How's everyone doing? Anything new going on, guys? Let us know in the comments. Uh, Hannah is sharing hey. some amazing links of our videos uh, thanks to Hannah. help some people out. Love you, Hannah. And let's see here. We have a super, super newbie that we hey. can help out today. Alicia M says, when using vinyl, any vinyl, do you have to take the white backing off or leave it on and stick it to the mat? That's a great question. So when you're cutting vinyl, you want that backing to be on the mat. So that white backing is the, what is keeping it from being ruined. Um, it's like that protection. It's like a sheet. sticker. It's, it's a sti sticker. Think of it like a sticker. So of course you would cut with that sticker backing on. And believe it or not, you tell your machine what material you're cutting, whatever type vinyl. Be sure to specify if it's glitter vinyl, regular vinyl, holographic vinyl, things like that. Um, that's important. And believe it or not, it will not cut through that backing sheet. So then you'll be able to weed your project and put your transfer tape on top of yeah, it. Yeah, if you're using the iron on, it won't cut through the backing sheet, which is right, why, you, nice. why you have to tell it right. the specific settings, you know, because the Cricut's super smart. You've just got to help it just a little bit. Yeah. So did, she was speaking on just regular vinyl, right? Now, I think right? so, yeah. Okay, great. In great, which great, case, great. yeah, it's just sticky. Yay. Yeah, it's just sticky. Super fun. Like a sticker, just like Rachel says. And Tanya says, how often do people change their mats? So like, I wish we need to do it one time. We need to like write on the calendar the day that we <laughs> open up a fresh mat. Yeah. Because that's some things that people, but I guess it depends on how often you use it, mm -hmm. what types of materials you use it on. Like for me and Tanner, our... Um, Light grip mats can last if we're can. just using yeah. like iron on. Yeah, but... Like, and it's really, you wouldn't think so, but the strong grip mats we use for nothing but our wood and mm -hmm. our super, super Chip strong board. material. Yeah, and those, they go the quickest, definitely. They do. They get so unsticky, but it's just because but you the get material a lot of value we're using, definitely. Out of it. Yeah, I and would you say, gotta have them. Yeah, I don't know how many cuts we get out of it. Maybe like, I don't wanna give a number. I'm not gonna give a number. Yeah. Um, Depending on how much you use it or the materials yeah. you use, but with all like the wood little pieces, it, it just gets unstuck quickly yeah you know with how we use it but definitely clean your mats now cricket does not recommend that's true that's cleaning true. your mats but there's some hacks around it if you want to you know go your own way yeah. and try and, and our them. video has like a lot of views so a lot of controversy in the comments it's one of our most controversial videos um because of the process the method we use a lot of people just recommend soap um and water it does work but if you watch the entire video 
please watch this oh yeah video. there's like a special solution there's some scraping involved some letting set involved yes oh we just went through all the tips for you guys to give you all the most successful matte cleaning that yeah we can. so you want to do that and the reason why is we've tested different ways that is the best way to get the lifespan on it um which is important of course but it does work we are living proof of that so be sure when you're watching that video to follow along pretty precisely and tanner before you even get to weeding this big old easy press takes a while to it heat does up. let's go ahead and turn that on i would whip her on yes now guys when you are picking out your iron-on project and things like that be sure to have your cricut printable god if you're a member um downloaded i'm going to share with you why Obviously, it's such a great guide. Um, we have terminology for beginners or anyone that always wants to remember what weld does versus attach, things like that. Um, we love that. We have blade charts on which blade to use, which are wonderful, because I forget about which blade cuts what a lot. But then I love this one. We were talking about it earlier, which mat to use for what material. Awesome. But then I love our easy press temperature chart. I hated having to go online yes, and look every it's single so time. It's so handy. But yeah, so all you want to do is look at every day, and then we're using 100% cotton. So we're going to set it to 315 and be able to do a warm peel. But if I you are this. if you <clears throat> are a member and you don't want to print this out and laminate like we have, Save you can it. so easily go on the, your dashboard and check it, check the PDF digitally. I mean, yeah, it's super you can, easy. what I love is that you can check it um, without having to download it or print it. You can save it to your computer. Scoot that up just a hair tanner. There you go. Thanks. So we're cutting off this excess vinyl right now. I wanna make sure I do not get too close to our cuts because we're going to save this piece for a later project this is how we take our scraps and rachel has a great hack um to write what type of iron on it is on like right here or somewhere so that you never forget it um that's because let me tip. tell you you can open up some um sport flex and you're like i know this is sport flex but when you throw it in the bin with a hundred different scrap pieces you're not going to remember that that's sport flex in a month sometimes it's hard to guess if you're an absolute cricket master maybe you could but for us just you know whipping our hands in there all all day long just trying to get her some scrap pieces you know they need to be labeled just it's just easy it definitely is and we have a lot of people commenting a super fun hack to uh, write the date that you open up your mat on the back of your mat. So just write, that. just, you know, with a Sharpie, just jot down the date and that, that can help you like get a, you know, an average time lifespan that the mats can give. Definitely, I love that, it's such a great hack. They're good at that. They, I swear guys, you all sometimes amaze me. All with, the time with for all me. the knowledge that you all have. Like Tanner, when me and you came on the live and we were like, guys, when you scrape your vinyl projects before Hi. you weed them, it's so easy. And half the people were like, uh, I've been doing this yeah, for years. Rachel. You're slow. <laughs> <laughs> but you guys are so smart and knowledgeable. And you all teach us and we teach you. It's a great exchange here in this crafty community. Yes. And it's so nice. I forget. Um, like, I don't know what it would be like to not have this community, for to have other like minded people to chat with. Um, to help us not feel so alone because like my friends and family, they don't know anything. When, I mean, you could mention the word cricket or die cutting. And they're like, what? Yeah. And even though we're making, I wouldn't say an advanced project, but it's a project that I wouldn't recommend to like 100% newbies, but newbies are here, um, on, you know, on the chat here today, asking questions. They're not afraid to ask questions. We love to answer but here's new the thing. cricket questions. It, we're not like turning people away because they're new or this or that. It's it just would a community be, for everybody. Like the reason why this is not, you know, if you're like, wait, why is this not a beginner project? Let me clarify what Rachel means by that. So we have projects that are honestly one step projects yeah it's we just that files. we're using two fonts and mixing a file in it's just because like the complexity of how you build this project it's right. not the project itself we say. have tons of projects and files that are perfectly going to be great for you guys that are beginners and we're talking about hundreds guys hundreds like 700 that you can pick a trendy file pop it on a t-shirt and have a craft success today that's like in under 15 minutes yeah that's part of the value of our membership um, is that we are here to help you guys, um, inspire you guys, and help you through the complicated projects, as well as giving you that value to give you success every single time. Yes, and here on the channel, we love to mix those in. So we give you very easy projects, like we just made 
a little ring dish the other day and then today we're using two different fonts from our font collections and one file from a collection we had last year. And we contoured it. Yes, we contoured it. We, you know, sized all the fonts. We're just trying to give you all all the information we can so that you all can grow in your crafting Definitely. and in your cooking. And if you're watching and you're a beginner and you're like, oh my gosh, I'm new to the software, this is a great time. I mean, in under an hour, you're learning lots about your machine, lots about the software. You're learning tips about weeding, you know. Learning apps you download, yeah. you know, to make it easier on your iPad. Little t tricks like this, um, what do you, smart guides and things like that, you know. Definitely, so if you're a beginner, and you are considering membership today you can get 20 percent off if you use that first link down below it was supposed to end yesterday but you guys asked for a little extension um in case of, i made you know, a boo-boo really it's why it's because i made a boo -boo. rachel had but a mistake okay. while i was gone it's okay i did like the whole <laughs> live stream pumping up the 20 percent off and the link wouldn't even work so so we fixed it for yep. anyone confused and things like that um, it is corrected and whatnot. So. Yes, so where yeah. you see our little confetti in the yeah. first... Um, first link down below. Yeah. So here's what we're going to do. I'm going to get all these scraps. Now, I love having a little scrap bin to put these scraps in as you weed. Like a tissue box. A little tissue box. I want to put marble contact paper over a tissue box because I think uh, that'd be super cool. Cute tissue boxes aren't enough for Tanner. He has to cover it in marble contact paper. Well, you guys saw me using that marble contact paper. I'm obsessed like with it. Like a pro. You guys would love it if you have not already used it. Highly recommend. Now, I want to blow some of your minds. I, If you watch Blaze's video after we did her unboxing, I was teaching her how to use iron-on, um, which was one of the first times I had said yes to a uh, helping a friend understand their machine. I don't usually have a lot of friends getting machines. So it was so much fun to first hook her up with some great supplies, but then teach her all my tips and tricks. This is a tip that we haven't talked about a lot. And since we have some bit newbies in here, I'm gonna give you all of them. So if you're working with a t-shirt, here's what I would do. Especially larger t-shirts that larger you're like, t-shirts. Eh. Yeah, we've preheated our easy press already. Now here's what we're gonna do. We have our design all good to go. Set that to the side. We're gonna take the t-shirt, and we're gonna fold it. And how I like to make sure it's folded is line up these pockets together. So line up Wait, these pockets. Wait, why would you, I think you're supposed to fold it the other way. It's fine. Either way? Mean, either way. Huh. We're folding it right here. And this, what this is gonna do is go give us the center of the t-shirt. So we make sure our design is smack dab in the middle. So right here, we have folded. You can see here. So we're gonna lay it down. We're gonna take our easy press and press it for like five seconds. Just Tanner like just so. threw it on there. I just threw it on there. Um, and then what is gonna happen, when you open this t-shirt up, there is a very faint press line. So that gives you the exact middle of your project. Next, you're going to take your image and you're going to line up the last letters, which would be, for us, the life happens in that Ray Dunn. And I pinch the top of the iron on to give a crease and the bottom of the iron on. So we have the middle. And then the next tip, so you line this up, pinch, pinch, you have your line. The next process you do after you have those markings is you're going to use this right here and you're gonna position your iron on about three inches from the neckline. Now I like to eyeball it just to see how well I'm doing with my <laughs> lining up methods and things like that. So here's what we're going to do. And if you want to switch it, like I can switch cameras if you can line Go it up. Go for it. Yeah, go for it. So I'm, I've, look guys, I eyeballed it and it's right at around three inches, which is awesome. I think that's totally fine. Now here is why I want to say, do not go by your transfer. Oh yeah. Because what happens is, look at how much extra we have over here versus over here. So we can't fold it there. We had to line it up where our S and our L was. Yeah, that's why Tanner said the last letter. Last not, letters. But you can't fold your transfer paper. That's right. never trustworthy. Never trustworthy. You know? Yeah. So again, let's recap this. If you're a newbie using iron-on, you fold the t-shirt, line up the two arm sleeves, fold, heat for five seconds, create that line. Second, line up the two widest letters and then crease the top of the transfer tape, crease the bottom of the transfer tape. So Once you're, not, you're, you're go, not messing up your image, you're just creasing it to give you a little cue. Yes. Now, second, or whatever step, whatever <laughs> tip which, number whichever. we're at, we're using the easy press mat below us, which is wonderful. 
um, and that's going to be able to send that heat back up. Highly recommend it. When I have that mat, I usually do not preheat it. Feel free to preheat your shirt for 15 seconds. I have already positioned my image down perfectly, so we're good to go. So I'm going to lift this up and I'm going to press down here with pressing this button and let it time down for 30 seconds. So if you want to go back to that wide camera whenever you want, this is just better angle. I should have zoomed out before we started using it's okay. the Okay, I'd press. rather than be able to see the design space more yeah. clearly. So we're just going to... Melanie says, I suck at weeding. <gasps> no, it, you get better at it. You figure out a groove. I was teaching Blaze some tips and tricks on weeding. Um, and it's really powerful once you get the hang of it. And you really want to find like your meditative groove with it. So we've and hit it for 30 seconds. And practice makes perfect, definitely. Yeah. Now it re um, recommends a warm peel. But just for safety, we're going to turn it around back. And we're going to hit the back of the shirt for another like 10, 15 seconds. If you have this discoloration, which you can kind of see faintly, um, it, as soon as the shirt cools down, it will not have that. So <clears throat> I love using the large easy press, but I also love using the nine by nine as well. Um, and the second number, the second best way to support everything we do here is to use our shop Cricut link down below to let Cricut know um, that's an affiliate link. So it lets them know that we helped you guys decide on a Cricut, on a machine, anything like that. Um, you can use our code MGL. That gives you 10% off your order and free shipping over $50, but it does not work on buying anything um, like a machine. So yeah. And uh, Crystal has a question. Hey, it's Crystal. a good one too. She says, which membership gives you everything? That's a great question. Our year membership is going to get you everything we talked about here. It's your best economical value, first of all. Second of all, you're getting the bonus courses, which are going to help you all across the board, whether you're a beginner or advanced crafter. And third of all, you're getting fonts. Yes. So with the yearly fun. membership, you get every resource we have to give. You get everything we've got. Yes. So we love that. Now, for some reason here, this iron mount is not sticking perfectly, so I'm going to hit it. I think I may not give it enough pressure. So in this case, I'm lowering my Look at tables. him. Look, look, look. Okay, I guys. Okay, Courtney, I have to. Oh, <laughs> gosh. Courtney, we were, we were filming some videos here today. Courtney had the table so low. When I went back, back behind her after we got everything set up and I was, uh, you know, moving some things around in the set, guys, it cut off half my head when I was, oh, That's God. That's hilarious. She's it. just so little. It's perfect. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Your mic isn't working. My mic isn't working? Nope. It could have been because I was messing it up. Testing, testing. Oh, no. It's a little, it's low. Look at my poor levels. Hello. Is it dead? Courtney was <gasps> using yours today. Is it dead? Give me batteries. <gasps> oh no. Not good. Oh, wait, Rachel's mic's still working. Woohoo! Yeah, mine's working fine. Thank you. Make sure you throw those away. It's a no no to keep old batteries. We'll get them fixed, guys. Everyone's freaking out. Okay, guys, it's fine. We got we've got new batteries going in. We got this, guys. Don't even worry. What's wrong? Maybe I put the batteries in wrong. Maybe. I did. Okay. That's well, that's okay. Court is fun size, Jenny. She is. Oh Every my time gosh. I see Court, she's We're a back. Little. We're back, guys. You all are the best. Whew, I was nervous. Tanner, we're having too much crafty fun for them to go anywhere. I They're know, not going to go I know, anywhere. I know. I know. I know. So okay, um, Rachel, what Is are the it not odds? Sticking? What are the odds we had? Well, okay, this is weird. The top has been great. Or maybe the t-shirt, man. Look at this. It just. Do you want me to totally... switch angles? Yeah, let's switch angles real quick. Okay, I have no idea, but this iron-on this batch was sticking so much for a hmm. cotton t-shirt. Everything's fine. Was the easy press on 330? It was on 330 and the huh. chart recommended 315. So it wasn't that it wasn't hitting it, but it was just really stuck to our transfer tape for some reason. But let me tell you, like this right here is solid. Like you can stretch the shirt right now. Oh yeah, no, she ain't going nowhere. It's not going anywhere. 
but it's just so weird that that corner gave me that issue. So anyway, here's our shirt. How adorable. I don't know if Courtney is going to get this shirt. She I, wanted it. And I said, I Courtney, kinda, honey, it's a large. I kind of want to keep this for myself. Like, what a funny little little quote. It's so cute. Um, Life happens. Tacos help. Who else can agree with that? Me. Hello. Taco Me, Tuesday definitely. does not happen near enough. And this table is way too low. We bring in the yeah, table. She had it oh. lower than that. I'm telling you. Oh, she had it way low. She guys. had it almost to the ground. Yeah. I was waiting. It was and like I the was lowest like low. bent over. Yes. Okay. There we go. Eh, right here's good. But yeah, what do you guys think? We have the blue version. We have our beautiful burnt red that Courtney is in love with. That this shirt would eat her up. There's no way she can wear it. She could wear it as like a not like a gown at night. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Love maybe. her to death. She's so little. But yeah, so we have two awesome takes on this Lift t-shirt. Lift that one up. Yes. I love it. You guys, now let's recap everything we went over in today's class. We talked about today's using. Today's class. <laughs> I know. It's like a free class every single day. And guess what? If you have your year membership, if you have a membership, you don't feel left out because yeah. we give you everything we talk about. Or if you don't, if you love this video or any of the lives we give you, any that's of our just videos. a little snippet to how much you're going to absolutely adore your membership because yeah. you can make stuff like this. You can this. make this. So again, recapping, Ray Dunn font, spontaneous taco from the Life Celebrations collection. Yes. Um, we talked about designing. We talked about iron on, weeding, using the easy press, using our temperature sheet gar chart chart. <laughs> in the Cricut printable guide, which you get as a free gift. If you are a member, you get this guide, um, not a physical copy, digital copy to print and do what you would like with. Um, so much fun. Join today and you get access to all of our fonts. We have 20% off ending today. So be sure to click that first link down below and get access for everything right here. You can see we have all kinds of fun stuff happening. And Tanner, I have to cut you off because let me just tell you, okay, Tara, Tara, Tara knows what I'm talking about. Hey, she Tara. said, I love the burnt red wind. I'm telling you, I, I say burnt red and Tanner's like, why do you call it burnt? <laughs> it looks like burnt red. It's an awesome color. I love it's so this cool, color. But yes, Tara, so I love the red. So yes, if you have not got your year membership, guys, it is Friday. Hopefully payday for you. Treat yourself to a membership because this year membership, 20% off. You get grandfathered in for this rate. You get the financial incentive. You get the fonts. You get the courses. Lots of bonuses happening. 80 more fonts coming out on the um, in April, and it's our best value. So lots of great stuff happening. We've had people say yes to our membership and um, haven't been able to cancel other memberships. I'm not going to mention exactly which ones, but yeah, they love it. They love the Facebook community. They love their commercial license. The fonts are great. We had Pam talk about how she was able to sell out a huge order um, of t-shirts for a local school, I believe. Lots of great stuff happening. It's Friday. This year membership is a gift that'll keep on giving. Um, so we absolutely love it. Our members are super happy with their memberships, which means that everything we do is working. And if you're a member, I just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you for um, believing in us and enjoying all of the benefits. We have the best group ever. Um, I'm getting a phone call from my mother. Um, we have the best group ever. So I just want to say thank you guys. It's really awesome to serve each and every one of you. And if you're considering membership, um, I promise it is something you're going to love. We put a lot of work into our files, our fonts. They're all exclusive to you guys. No, not sold anywhere else, which is a huge bonus. So yeah. Are there any questions? No, I, Peggy has been the best assistant today answering oh, all the Peggy. questions perfectly. Well, great. So Are Peggy, any... Peggy's like I remember the day today Yay, because Peggy. she's been amazing. So thank you so much, Peggy. Well, hey, are there any questions that Peggy's been helping answer that you think other members may be having the same question? Um, no, the only one was where is your table from? Because mm. people are loving your table that goes yes. up and down. I love that too. Um, it's really awesome. Um, yeah, so it's from Ikea. Mm -hmm. It is not the, you notice I have this crank. I chose to go with the cheaper option so I didn't have to plug it in because there's some things like There's the already table. too many cords in here anyways, Too many cords, you know? um, with the production and lights and And things. it's simple and it's easy. You it's just cheap. pull it out and you just crank yeah. it, you know? It's cheap. Um, and when I say cheap, it's not cheap for a table. It's cheap for a standing desk, oh, which man. is what it is. Them things are spancy. And there's a lot of surface area. Like it's a pretty it's a great size of desk. I mean, like, this is me like trying to like <laughs> like it's, it's a around. very large size. We have two. 
And what I like is once you buy the base, the tabletop, we go through them. We just had one of our team members oh, no. screw a hole through this Nobody one. will confess. No one will confess you well, did Well, Tanner it. was out of the office, and Tanner's going to the bottom of it, like, Monday. Rachel doesn't use power tools, <laughs> so I'm out, too. So, um, what I was, the point of that is you can replace these for less than 100 bucks, I believe. Um, so, that's kind of nice. But, yeah. It is you, nice, cause, and I think the lady who asked was in childcare. So, if oh, cool. your kids get paint everywhere or right. accidentally, you know, mark it up or whatever, you can change that tabletop yeah, out. Yeah, the base is what's expensive because of the, 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 crank. the cranks yeah, and mm -hmm. things and stuff like that. So, it's so much fun. Um, we love it. Are there any other questions about membership? We seriously hope that if you've been on the fence and enjoying these free videos that you will take advantage of it um, to treat yourself to a membership. If you have a die cutting machine, you're bound to enjoy all the things we have to offer. So yeah, um, no, no more yeah. questions. Christina says uh, she's really excited for the fonts coming out this month. Um, they come out in April. So another month, um, we had a launch in January and then there's a launch in April. So it's every quarter, guys. So a quarter is three months. So January was Q1. Q2 starts in April. Mm. So yeah, great, awesome stuff. You guys, guys, April's going to be jam-packed. I've been... March is going to be jam-packed. I mean, every so month. The summer's going to be jam-packed. The fall is going to be jam-packed. Okay, guys, this year is going to be jam-packed. Yeah, it's a lot of great stuff. Be sure to use the first link down below to enjoy 20% off your membership. Um, I'm going to actually post that link to join. If you guys have any questions or need the link or anything like that, let me just pop that link down there for everyone that's considering it. If you have a die cutting machine and you're like, I want to use it more and I need help, um, we're here for you. Like me and Rachel want to be your crafty friends. Lots of people are talking about how excited they are for this month's collection launch. Yeah. Um, yeah, which is it's, be it's good. the Tuesday after next. So not this coming Tuesday, but the Tuesday after. We've got we've got a bunch of awesome stuff hitting you guys. So Rachel, you have we told them it. what the collection is, yeah. No, and we're not gonna We're not going to No. <laughs> no. It's a surprise. Oh my gosh. I love it. Um, yeah, so I just posted the link right down there. If you guys need help in design space, if you need help using cut files fonts, things like that. Our membership has got your back. You're bound to enjoy it. Um, we have over 2,000 very happy members and we would love to serve you as well. So hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. We'll see you back here real soon getting crafty with even more amazing projects. Rachel, I also want to just compliment okay. um, on, there was a comment on yesterday's video All talking right. about how much they enjoyed your individual live streams. Oh, And it had like five thumbs up. <laughs> So lots oh. of people are just loving all of the videos you're doing. So. I'm so glad. I'm so yeah. glad. I love, you know, helping you all. And I learn, you know, some things as I'm crafting too. And, cra I, you know, I'm, who else gets paid to craft? I'm, I'm so blessed to have this job. Yes, so I'm so glad you is. all are enjoying it. And, and let me know what you'd like me to do more of, yeah. you know. Stephanie, you have to in download our fonts individually and our collections per collection. So that's a great question. Um, for but you that. can look at the PDF file. It's so yes. easy oh, to yes. find the so ones have, you want. Right. So we have this PDF guide for fonts as well as cut files. Yes, we cannot forget them. about that resource. It's I love awesome. these resources. So again, guys, it's lots of value in the membership. Have so much fun. Enjoy your weekend. Stay crafty. And if you're down south, um, stay dry and as well as on across Just the whole get country your boats the world. out. Yeah, stay dry. Enjoy the weekend. <laughs> get crafty. It's a great weekend to get an excuse and for everyone that's going to be attending the summit get prepared it's about here a it, week yeah, away yeah lots of fun get your ticket if you missed out on that and again happy crafting see you guys later bye